These are five of Mark Cuban's top cryptocurrencies, starting with his heated debate on Bitcoin when Bill Maher would compare it to holding gold. Gold. Okay. Everybody likes to- You know what? If you have gold, you're dumb as It's always worth something. You can always sell it. Just and Bitcoin. Bitcoin, gold is a store of value and so it's, is Bitcoin. That, that's not, Bill Maher was very against Bitcoin while Mark Cuban advocates for its value as a strong investment. Bill would talk about gold as if it's a hedge against everything and wants Bitcoin to just fall off and lose its value. Else it's a henchman against everything, but- Yes, it is. It's no, a, and, would I be but it's all not in gold? Hedge, no. No, but it's not a hedge against anything, right? Funny enough, they share the same take that Mark Cuban also wants Bitcoin to go down in value, but for the sole reason of just buying a whole lot more. He sees it as a much better investment than gold, but the main reasons why he likes Bitcoin so much is because of its decentralized nature and compelling store of value as an investment. But he's not just bullish on Bitcoin, especially compared to his favorite crypto being Ethereum. Ethereum I like the best. Right? Oh, me too. Ethereum is driven by utility, right? A reason yes. to use it. With Ethereum being a platform that allows developers to build decentralized applications using smart contracts, its utility lies in its ability to provide a transparent environment for executing agreements and creating these dApps without the middleman. Not to mention, it's of course on a decentralized network, meaning there is no authority controlling the platform, which creates a resistance to censorship or foul play. All transactions on the Ethereum blockchain are public and immutable, which means they can't be changed or deleted as well. Ethereum simply makes it extremely easy for developers to build applications and open new opportunities for collaboration in the future. So among many features, these are just a few reasons why billionaire Mark Cuban keeps his eye on it. In terms of applications with smart contracts, that's only 2017 for the most part. And so we're really only five years in. Mark Cuban has also shown a keen interest in a project that aims to combat climate change by using blockchain technology. This environmentally conscious project is KlimaDAO. And for an investor like Mark that has always been interested in innovative technologies and disruptive business models, this seems to be a perfect fit for his investment philosophy. Klima is a decentralized autonomous organization that uses blockchain technology to purchase and retire carbon credits, which are tradable permits that allow companies to emit a certain amount of greenhouse gases. By retiring these carbon credits, Klima effectively reduces the overall carbon emissions in the atmosphere, which can actually make a positive change on the environment. Now, what about a user-friendly gateway to the world of blockchain and cryptocurrencies? Well, thanks to Mark Cuban, along with other massive investors, Blockto was able to close their Series A funding round at an $80 million valuation. Hope is there for this platform that aims to make blockchain technology more accessible to mainstream consumers. Basically, Blockto is a non-custodial wallet and gateway that enables users to securely access and store various cryptocurrencies and decentralized apps. With the platform's user-friendly interface and various strong features, features such as one-click logins and social recovery, Mark also sees the platform's potential to create new business models and revenue streams, such as in-app purchases and loyalty rewards. And as an early adopter and prominent supporter of the project, Mark has expressed his excitement about its potential to create a new business model that aligns profits with positive social and environmental outcomes. Now, Mark Cuban has a long-standing reputation as a sharp investor with an intimate understanding of game-changing innovations. He views a project known as Injective Protocol with the potential to fundamentally alter the way we see decentralized finance. It can have the potential to make DeFi more accessible than ever before, thanks to its emphasis on a special layer two solution that enables incredibly quick transactions. Mark views that Injective Protocol is well positioned to benefit from the exploding growth in the industry and that the platform's potential to allow endless markets is a game changer. He seems eager to be a part of this groundbreaking technology and is betting on a project with the potential to change the financial landscape. Also to see the top 10 cryptos that other rich investors are buying right now, be sure to check out this video here. Just don't forget that Mark Cuban picked from thousands of options and just because he invests in these projects doesn't mean you should as well. Because trust me, he has the money to lose. Always make your own financial decisions and do your own research.